Alright everybody, we're back. That was a that was a that was a fun video, wasn't it? Yep. Yeah, some some of the books that we do for our morning meeting, we see that they've got songs on there, right? That was a fun song someone made up just for that story. Right? I liked it. We're building a house, we're building a house, a job for everyone. We're building a house, we're building a house, a job for everyone. We won't stop till it's done. No, they said. Again, we've used these paper strips. You can buy these at, um, online. Lakeshore Learning has them. Um, they work great, especially for our school agers that are getting ready for kindergarten to learn to write in the lines, right? There. Is it slippery? Luckily, I'm all stretched out on the splits, otherwise, I could hurt myself. We don't want you to hurt yourself. Luckily, I would. Thank goodness. Okay. 
You want that on the back? Oh. Yep, you're trying. There you go. Okay, good job. Okay, Joe, good job. All right, so today I'm going to get out our board here. And of course, I didn't grab my eraser. That's from the other day. How was the gym yesterday? Did everybody have fun going to the gym? Yep, we went to the gym yesterday. Yeah, we should go and sit there again. You like that? Mm -hmm. Did you have yeah, fun? I like the car. Yeah, you like the car? Yeah, we have to make bus. You're making a lot of Fs. You're doing a good job. Alrighty, guys. Dad, it's going to be dead. Today. Should we go through dad? Yeah. yeah. We can do that. Dad. We can go through dad. Let's I write the word dad. I don't like mom. Hey, dad. What do you start with? A D. You're going to be on the left side. I did a D. Can you make a little D? Show me a little D. I know you can make a big D. Can you, show me a little D? you did it. Chase, you got it. I did it. That's a P. You did it. Very good. Dad, mad, these two rhyme, dad, 
mad. These two rhyme, they sound the same at the end. Add. They both have add. So they sound the same at the end. That makes them a rhyme. Right? So now we've got dad mad. How about sad? How do we spell the word? Sad. Yeah, that looks like a W and an M. Yeah, I think I used all my papers, so I'm going to go on the other side. So we start with an S, and what do we get next? We start on the side. Uh, on the left. There you go. So I start on the side, huh? Nope, at the dots. Let me see, Chase. So Chase sad, wrote it fabulous. Sad. I like sad. Maeve, can you make an S? Can you show me an S? Can you try? Just show me how you try. That's a good S. What comes next? What? Yeah. Just tell them no. There we go. We've got sad. Chase. Okay. I think you're the best ever. 
fighting the word chase. All right, we're going to do this. Numbers, numbers, numbers have names. What is the name of this number? Ready? Here. So we are all good. 
Oh, I just found honey. I'll bring him next week, though, okay? And then cheese. Around the ball. What do you want me to do, Shelly? Uh, here. You can have a seat. Uh, we'll get out of the way. Shelly, I want you to move the chair and we can both sit on. Um, well, I think the chair should, I think that chair should stay there. I think you're good, Chase. Shelly, I want to sit there. Great big chair by yourself. Shelly, can I sit there? Can I sit there too? 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 This one. I'll take you guys off the table. This one here is, these are rhymes. And everybody, you know what a rhyme is? It's when you say words that sound the same. I don't want to you know see that. Well, I'll do that after this. Right after this. Because they're just a bunch of real little, little short ones. Watch, a real small rhyme. So just that's the whole rhyme. That's the whole thank, rhyme. Thank so you, thank you guys. We'll read them afterwards, okay? And I'll put these here so I don't mix them up. Hey, Chase. Miss Miss I'm Jay. Nice. And then you did. Yeah. 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 Sticks up with a rope and you get hooks up. It's a crane. And you get hooks up. It works. It's fun to make stuff like that. I have Legos and I have. Did everybody know? You guys probably already know who the Berenstein Bears are, huh? Did everybody know? Jackson has a bunch of Legos. Legos? Yeah. I have two Legos. I have erector sets too. And they're really fun. I bet you it does. <laughs> Did you ever accidentally step on a Lego? Oh, does it hurt? <laughs> That's why I, I always pick mine up when I'm done. Otherwise, I step on them and it hurts. Ready to read Bernstein Bears Go to School? Is that good? Yeah. Okay. And we know these are the Bernstein Bears, right? You know that. See them? Those are all the Bernstein Bears. Now, let's hear about their first day in school, okay? You ready, Teddy? You good? Think There's Teddy's ready? I see that, Teddy. yeah. There's big Teddy and little Teddy. Or is it Teddy 1 and Teddy 2? There's two, two Teddies. <laughs> and we call that Teddy, Teddy T. Teddy T? Okay. And Hi, Teddy that, T. And that is Grandpa Dog. Teddy. Hey, Grandpa Dog, you know what's going to happen tomorrow? What? Why he's going to have his boyfriend. He's going to be two. And he's going to have You're a gonna pot. Be two? Someday you guys are all going to be sitting here and tell me, guess what? Riley's going to be 100. <laughs> okay. A gym? here and we'll see him. Okay? Ready? My voice is really weak, so we got to listen quiet. No, wait a second. It's not weak, though. We have a new kid here today sitting at the table. See her? <laughs> it's been a I know. Let's, let's hear what this person says about the Bernstein Bears. It's been a wonderful summer for the Bear family. They went swimming and boating at the lake. They picnicked in the woods, and they took a lot of long walks. But now summer's over, and it's getting cold. The birds are beginning to fly south, and the leaves are changing colors. How come the birds fly south? Anyone know? Because they have wings. That's how they fly south. But they fly south because it's warm down there in the winter. It's too cold up here. Huh? It's too cold. 
Yeah, they don't have jackets. Yeah, this, this too is cold. Yeah. Um, One evening yeah. at supper, Brother Bear said, I'm getting tired of summer vacation. I think I'm ready to go back to school. <laughs> that is good news, said Papa Bear. School will be starting again very soon. Sister Bear's ears perked up at the word school. Mama Bear noticed. As a matter of fact, she said, Sister and I are going to meet her new teacher tomorrow. This year, this year, Sister will be starting kindergarten. Is anybody going to start kindergarten next year? Not me. You, you're going to be a kindergartner? No, nope, me. No. Nope. Chase and Joe and Quinn are all going to kindergarten in the fall. Where did Joe go? Oh, he's right. No. No, nope, right there. Joe and Chase. Oh, I'm, oh, I'm always thinking of uh, James. James, yeah. I'm, I'm sorry. Joe. It's Joe Chase. Joe, so, Chase, and Quinn. Oh. She's going to go to kindergarten in the fall. I'm you know, going to did you meet your teacher yet? No, they haven't gotten to meet their teacher yet, but they, Quinn did get to go and see her classroom. Is it big? Is it pretty? I had a birthday party. I'm in the water. Yeah, so did I. I had, I had some. Girls, princesses? Yep. When, when my grandson went to kindergarten this year, he uh, didn't want to leave school. He was having so much fun. He was crying. My daughter couldn't drink. She picks him up once or twice a week, and she's had so much fun. Okay. You ready? I'll start over. I always end up talking too much. That's my problem. This year, her sister will be starting kindergarten, and she wasn't quite sure how she felt about it. She liked being at home with mom and dad, her books and her toys, and all of her friends. What will school be like, Mama? She asked at that time. You'll find out tomorrow, said Mama, as she tucked her sister and kissed her goodnight. Oh, see it, Daddy? Um, I know. That's pretty good. The next day, he just looked at that one. See, they're all talking and wondering what you're gonna, what it's gonna be like. See? It? Andy Bear Gus was up on the ladder fixing the roof. Hello, said Mama. This is Sister Bear. We know who Sister Bear is right there. She starts kindergarten next week. We'll be glad to have her, said Gus. Just wait. Just wait. This honey bear is the kindergarten teacher. You'll find her outside. I know. I had a friend we used to call him Honey Bear. Yeah, that's, that's the teacher. She, you know what her name is, Danny? Honey Bear. Miss Honey Bear. <laughs> She's Miss Honey Bear. I know. What a big, friendly room. It had yellow curtains and tables and chairs and looked just right for someone's sister's size. There she is. Beautiful room. <laughs> You're pretty happy today, huh, Ken? Is he always happy? Yes, pretty much. You're always happy? What do you do in kindergarten? She asked as he sat down for lunch. We read stories, sing songs, learn our ABCs, paint pictures, play games, make things out of clay, build with blocks. We do lots of things, said Miss Honeybear. Hey, that's like being here, isn't it? You learn a lot. I know. Those are all things sister liked to do. And she had never seen such big jars of paint. Whoa. No, there they are. And there was even a whole barrel of clay. You know what a barrel is? That thing is this big and this big around and it's full of clay. There it is. See it? See it? 
School might be fun after all, thought sister, by the time she and Mama started home. But when the big morning came, sister began to worry. Is anybody going to worry when they go to kindergarten? No. No. It's going to be fun. No. Mama said, what if, Mama, she said, what if I don't like school? What if I just don't like it? Just then, the big yellow school bus pulled up behind by the tree in the house. Stop worrying, said Brother Bear. School is fun. You will like it. Now let's get going or we'll miss our bus, just like Aiden did this morning. Oh, that's not him. <laughs> <laughs> he left the house at 5 after the bus picks him up at 6 after. Can I see? You walk. Can I see? Yeah, sure. Can I see? See? Can I'm I waiting see? for the bus. Can Here comes the bus. I have a and I'm waiting to get on. I have a seat. Yep. Did you ever ride on a school bus? Who rides on a school bus? I have a seat. Sounds like here. It does sound like here. I was in kindergarten again. 
When she climbed off the bus with brother at the end of the day, sister was excited. Mama, Papa, look. Oh. I, I should have my glasses on. Mama, Papa, look at what I did to school today. And she was holding up her panty. A few days later, the weather turned warm again. And does it really fall? Brothers, brother was restless at breakfast. I wish it was still summer, he said, so I wouldn't have to go to school. Mm -hmm. Well, come on, brother bear, said sister. School is fun. Let's get going or we'll miss the bus. On the bus, all the bears were talking about the things they were going to do in school today. Soccer practice, science projects, music lessons. Hmm, thought brother bear. Sister was right. School is fun. Donuts. And off they went in the big yellow bus <laughs> to the Bear County School. Here's, I like this picture right here. I like these pictures of showing what they're doing. See, they're playing with the bus. See that? This is what I like. A giant donut. See how big it is? It's not real, though. Really. Sure. I'll read some rhymes out of it. I won't read the whole book because there's a whole bunch of rhymes. But I'll read a couple of rhymes, okay? Do you guys remember what rhymes are? No. The words that rhyme and the same. Remember? And if I'm any good at it, I might make them sound like rhymes. I'm not real good at this. So. Let's see. This is about in the morning. If you're writing a rhyme about the morning. It says, Dirty with the yellow bill, hopped upon the windowsill, cocked his shiny eye and said, Did you shame with your sleepy head? Do you remember Axel and his dog? It's probably before your time. Kids show in the mornings. He also had one at noon, but the morning one we watched. And he opened his show with that one. I, I had no idea it was going to be there. And then at the end, his, his last thing was, I was a joke. And one, I, the one that sticks with me is this, burning with the yellow bill. He cocked his shining eye and said, what do you got in your hands, cakes? That was the funniest joke I ever heard in my life at the time. And it's still, 70 years later. Yes, so I remember it. Okay, ooh, here's one. Ooh. Old duty of children. Should we see if they made a rhyme about that? Yes. A child should always say what's true. Speak what he is spoken to. And behave mannerly at the table, at least as far as he is able. Can I see? Mm -hmm. You can look through all those pictures if you want. If you want me to read one of the rhymes? Yo, yeah, Jared, read, read together. Read together. Put it right in between you. So read. That's the best way to read. Yeah, just like that. Big turn. Yep, make sure you share. Yeah, yeah make sure you share. And if, you, if, if you want me to read one, let me know. Thank <laughs> you.
Grandpa got it for you work. Swimming? You know what a swim?
draw your picture. Because it could hurt us. You're a scratch. Oh, yeah.